Hi, I'm Keith Melton, the founder of the new Cane Masters. Now often our customers are sending us in canes to evaluate. And a gentleman in Alabama sent us his Walmart quad cane. He had purchased it, he's 70 years old, a little taller than I am, and he had some problems with it, but he asked us to evaluate it professionally. Well, several things come to mind. Number one, if you're taller, this isn't gonna work for you. Basically, I'm just under six feet. If I'm 6'1", this is too short. It doesn't extend high enough, which is a problem. But his difficulty is that he fell using it. Now, in theory, you would think that anything with four legs probably should be more stable. Well, that's not what we are experiencing. We're finding, actually, it's more difficult to get it level to use. And if you're walking on any type of uneven terrain, could even be grass, gravel, rocks, uh, anything, it's almost impossible to get all four legs down at the same time. And though it may look more stable, we're certainly not seeing it. And that's essentially his problem because he fell using it. Another problem with the quad cane is it's not built for traveling. It's actually surprisingly heavy. It's not light and convenient. It's very inconvenient if you're traveling on a plane and you're trying to get this up in the overhead. This catches on everything. So it looks good. I guess if it's someone in a nursing home, an old folks home, and you know, all you want to do is kind of shuffle down to breakfast or lunch, maybe that's okay. But if you're thinking of something for self-defense, this would absolutely never work. Best thing you could do would be throw it at someone and try to run away. This is a standard, what we call a big box cane. If you go to one of your big discount stores, go to a pharmacy, this is likely what you're there gonna see for 10, $15. So it's all metal, it does adjust. One of the big weaknesses is if you're over six feet, this won't work for you. It does not extend long enough. Now, good things about it, has a nice big tip. In a way, this is more stable than a quad cane because I find it easier to understand exactly where I'm using it. It possibly could be used for self-defense, but it's so light, it's gonna break. I would not want to go up against a bad guy with this cane because I'd be concerned it's gonna fall apart or collapse the first time I strike with it. I'd be very concerned with ever using one of the big box or pharmacy canes if I was gonna protect my life and needed to depend on it. But I thought it would be interesting, it's easy to say that, but let's take a look at what happens when we actually try to break it. Now in the past, you can remember my son Luke, we used him as the guinea pig to hold the canes. Well, today he's the president of the company and too important for us, so we're gonna put this dummy here in the middle. I'm using a standard, inexpensive dojo training cane. This is our least expensive cane. It's a classic, and we'll just see how this compares. Now, would you want your life depending on this? And this is why do you don't want to bet your life on an inexpensive pharmacy or big box store cane. Comparatively, a good J-top cane has many advantages. It's one of the oldest, in some ways, the simplest ergonomic form for use. Uh, so let's compare it with the two. Number one, I can tailor it to my length. It's always gonna be the proper length design so I don't have to lean over, but I'm also not leaning back. I can effectively leverage the strengths of the cane. And always remember, keep the horn pointed forward, which is the most comfortable and efficient way to carry it. The next thing is any type of terrain I'm on, I find it's easier to get a firm grip because then I know exactly where to position the cane and I can adjust my body accordingly. And on rocks, gravel, other types of terrain, it's much easier for me to use. Traveling is much simpler. I can take it with me anywhere. It doesn't snag on things. Put it up in an overhead, it's much lighter, it's simpler, and it's much stronger. 
good quality American hardwood, you can bet your life on it. Remember, I'm Keith Melton. This is Kane Masters. We're here to help if we can.